Hey guys, so I just got some new little gear for my HD GoPro Hero 3. I had gotten this camera for $300 at Best Buy. But with that aside, now I've got some little toys for my GoPro. And as many GoPro users know, GoPro's gear is really expensive. Some of the prices are actually really truly ridiculous. Now I've got two of the products here which I've gotten to save a lot of money on just by going to Amazon.com. The first thing I am going to show you is the bike mount. This is by Cosmo. It was on Amazon for seven dollars and after shipping and handling my total came to 1207. Now for a handlebar GoPro mount it also includes the mount for the rear seat so you can put your GoPro right below your butt and film the back of it. It is $20. Now, after shipping and handling all that, I only spent $12 on this sucker and it actually works really, really well. And in a matter of fact, it is pretty sturdy. If you see here, I shot a couple of shots outside with my GoPro using this uh, little bike holder. And the best thing too about this, it actually fits on motorcycles too. It's actually built to hold on to a camera on a motorcycle. And that's not only the coolest thing about, about this, um, is it holds the GoPro, but it also can hold just a regular picture camera, like my Canon that I'm using right now. I use a Canon Elf 300HS for skits or for this review, in a matter of fact and it's easy to use right out of the package. You just unscrew and you just clip it onto the bike, which you can see right here. Boom, like so. When I did get this package, I did get a little frustrated at one point because if you see, this moves pretty, it, the ball moves, <laughs> and it moves really well. The, the sellers, they didn't really send directions just because it was so easy to use. I had some issues with this little piece right here. I thought it was just there for decorations because I was just looking at the top and it took me about five minutes before I, I looked at the bottom and realized that, hey, I can actually turn this. Just to, to tighten, the ball here, you just turn that till it tightens and the balls, the ball won't move. So it's a good little product. The product also came with a cord strap. So say if you're using your little point and shoot camera, you can just keep the, the little wrist holder out of the way by, you know, strapping it, you know, onto your handlebars. Also, it came with little rubber mats. It came with two of these. It was a really, really cool deal, and you can use this with any camera, just not one of the, your big, fancy DSLR cameras. The only issue, or the only thing I recommend is get a tripod mount for your GoPro. Now, online, these things are actually really super easy to make out of PVC pipes. Super easy to make, but I went the easy route and I just bought one. This little sucker, I won't really get to use in water, not until next week. But I got this on Amazon as well. If anybody knows, if you do decide to buy or are looking into buying a pole instead of making one, GoPro sells theirs for $50. Now, that's a little pricey. And from what I heard, it's not that great of a product. Considering GoPro makes some really, really cool cameras you would think they make really good accessories but I went online I just try to find an inexpensive pole and I came across this sucker and it's easy to use you just twist and pull it extends pretty far I'm not too sure how far out it goes um, I'm not that great with math but it's enough to be able to get all of your friends in the shot or just be able to use a pole when you're out doing your little activities. I shot a couple of shots using this, bugging my girlfriend and my dogs and my gnome, Charles. Very easy to use. 
Now this one, this one cost a little bit more, and if you look at it, it doesn't look like it should cost that much, but the cool thing about this little sucker when I got it is I not only paid for this pole, it came with a GoPro tripod mount, which I can just easily attach to my GoPro, no problem, and I am able to use product easily. Most of the time, or actually, these suckers, the tripod mount for the GoPro, are normally about $8 at Best Buy and on the website. Luckily, GoPro had just announced that they are doing free shipping and handling from now on without any codes or specials or promotions or anything like that. So that's good to hear. But this, this guy came with this, and all I spent was $21. On the website, it was $17. And I only, and with shipping and handling, it was 21 And it came with a tripod mount, which I wasn't going to turn down. That was a really good deal. And the cool thing is, you can expand it. Even if you don't want it to go that far, you don't have to let it go that far. You know, just turn and pull and twist. You know, super easy. And then twist and put away. And it's cool because it's small enough and you can just kind of put it away in your little backpack. I've got all of my little gear on amazon.com this right here bike mount I got from is by the company uh, Cosmo I will put the link of the product below in the description and this product here I actually went on the website for this product and I actually found a couple of more really cool GoPro little gadgets for super cheap like the suction cup the suction cup at Best Buy and on the uh, GoPro website is $30. They have a suction cup for your windows for $10 on the website. The company that sold this was Simpsons and Co. Inc. So check out that website. Uh, all the links are below to check out the products and the websites to see what else you can find for really good deals. But yeah, I just want to put in my review to see, let you guys see this really handy and super cheap product for your GoPro or for just any camera that you plan on using. I don't make enough money to, you know, do a lot of stuff or really afford, you know, super nice things all the time, but when I find a good deal, I find a good deal. And these were good deals. So I hope this is helpful and I hope you guys are able to get this as well and be able to save some extra cash to use on whatever else you want to do. Yeah, that's about it. Subscribe, and hopefully I will get more videos out soon. Uh, bye, guys.